thank you for this, Inquisitor. Uh, we are not far from where my friend was summoned. Okay. Hello. Is there uh, something we should do here? Solus, you said your friend was a wisdom spirit. That is not its natural form. It's been corrupted. Corrupted? Forced to act against its original purpose. What did they do? What did they do? What did they do? Perhaps we should ask. A mage! You're not with the bandits? Do you have any lyrium potions? Most of us are exhausted. We've been fighting that demon. You summon that demon! Except it was a spirit of wisdom at the time. You made it kill! You twisted it against its purpose! I, I, I understand how it might be confusing to someone who has not studied demons, but after you help us, I can... We are not here to help you! Uh. Word of advice? I'd hold off on explaining how demons work to my friend here. Listen to me! I was one of the foremost experts in the Kirkwall Sir. Shut up. The hell shit. You summoned it to protect you from the bandits. I... Yes. You bound it to obedience, then commanded it to kill. That is when it turned. The summoning circle. We break it, we break the binding. No orders to kill, no conflict with its nature, no demon. What? The binding is the only thing keeping the demon from killing us. Whatever it was before, it is a monster now. Inquisitor, please. Um, yeah, I think, yeah, let me do it, sure. I've studied rituals like this. I should be able to disrupt the binding quickly. Thank you. We must hurry! Okay. Don't attack the thing. I heard what it said. It was right. You did help it. No. I must endure. Let me know if I can help. You already have. All that remains now is then. Thank you. We would not have risked the summoning, but the roads are too. Why is she in the background? Unprotected. You tortured and killed my friend. We didn't know it was just the spirit. The, the book said it could help us. Um. Uh. I keep him out of it. Solus. They're too stupid. Never again. I need some time alone. I will meet you back at Skyhold. Inquisitor. How are you, Solus? It hurts. It always does. But I will survive. Thank you for coming back. You were a true friend. You did everything you could to help. I could hardly abandon you now. Where did you go? I found a quiet spot and went to sleep. 
I visited the place in the Fade where my friend used to be. It's empty, but there are stirrings of energy in the void. Someday something new may grow there. What happens when a spirit dies? It isn't the same for mortals. The energy of spirits returns to the Fade. If the idea giving the spirit form is strong, or if the memory has shaped other spirits, it may someday rise again. You're saying your friend might come back? No, not really. A spirit's natural state is peaceful semi-existence. It is rare to be able to reflect reality. Something similar may reform one day, but it might have a different personality. It would likely not remember me. It would not be the friend I knew. I'll let you get back to work. All right. Thank you again. Inquisitor, I was... Do you have a moment? What were you like, before the anchor? Has it affected you? Changed you in any way? Your mind? Your morals? Your... spirit? Well, I mean... I guess not. I don't believe so. Ah. Why do you ask? You show a wisdom I have not seen since... ...since my deepest journeys into the ancient memories of the Fade. You are not what I expected. What have I done that's so surprising? You have shown subtlety in your actions. A wisdom that goes against everything I expected. If the Dalish could raise someone with a spirit like yours... ...have I misjudged them? Um... Well, uh, uh, the Dalish didn't make me like this. The decisions were mine. Yes, you are wise to give yourself that due. Although the Dalish, in their fashion, may still have guided you. Perhaps that is it. I suppose it must be. Most people act with so little understanding of the world, but not you. So what does this mean, Solus? It means that I respect you deeply, Inquisitor. And I have disturbed you enough for one evening. Ow. I should inspect the condition of the trebuchets. They must be calibrated to reach the proper range. Again? How many times will you be doing that? Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> that's, that's, oh man. Nice. Nice. Oh, fuck you, EA! Fuck! You kidding me? That's it. Fuck it. I can't find the last part of the key. Fuck it. I'm out. Fuck this place. Inquisitor. Scout Harding. We're on the outskirts of Sarnia. This is what's left of the town. The lucky ones got out before the river froze over. The rest, penned in by Fade Rifts and Red Templars. We're the first friendly face they've seen in a long, long while. How did an entire river freeze so quickly? It got really cold, really quickly. Sarnia relies on its river for everything. Trade, food. They weren't expecting this. Here I come to save the day. Again. That's why we love you. Oh. The Red Templars have been mounting frequent attacks. They won in Prus du Lyon. Bad. Let's get out there and take it back from them. What the fuck's up here? <laughs> well, <laughs> that was that was totally worth it. Hello. Ah, the hero arrives. But is it hero or murderer? It's so hard to tell. You're the demon called Imshale. Uh, <clears throat> Choice spirit. Talky ones. 
We hate the talky ones. Wait, wait, wait! These are your friends? They're very violent. It's worrying. True to my name, I will show you that you have a choice. It doesn't always have to end in blood. Talk. That's how they get you. Simple. We don't fight, and I grant you power. Shower you with riches. Or maybe virgins. Your pick. The fuck? Then we all live happily ever after. Well, not all of us. But who's counting? Oh, God. I just wanted to see what would happen. Fuck him. No, I'm gonna kill him. You die, demon. Alpha. Choice. Spirit. Don't be smart. Be afraid. Oh, shit. Oh, man. He's a tough motherfucker. What am I doing? Uh. What the hell? Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought he died. We are different in every possible way. And not every way. There is my family. Your family of slave-owning Imperial Magisters. Ghastly, isn't it? Toss it all on the fire and be done with it. That's what I say. <laughs> Very well. There is that. I knew you'd come around. So, Dorian, about last night. Discretion isn't your thing, is it? Three times! Also, do you want those silky underthings back, or did you leave those like a token? Or, wait, did you forget them so you'd have an excuse to come back, you sly dog? If you choose to leave your door unlocked like a savage, I may or may not come. Speak for yourself. 